Let's write the decimal 0 0.06 as a fraction. So to do that, the first thing we can do is we can put 0 0.06 over 1. It's still equal to 0 0.06, but we have the start of a fraction now. What we need to do is get this to be a whole number. And to do that, we have one, two decimal places. Two decimal places, let's multiply this by 100, like this. So 100 times 0 0.06. 0, 6, that just equals 6. So we have a whole number here, but we can't just multiply the top by 100. We also have to multiply the bottom, the denominator by 100 as well, because 100 over 100, that's just 1. So we've not changed the value here, we're just changing the form. So 100 times 1, that is 100. And now we have a fraction with whole numbers. Let's give ourselves a little bit of room here. And we can take 6 over 100, and if we divide the numerator and the denominator by 2, we'll end up with 3 over 50. And 3 over 50, we can't simplify that any further. So when we convert 0 0.06, this decimal, to a fraction, we end up with 3 fiftieths. And if you divide 3 by 50, you're going to get 0 0.06. This is Dr. B, converting 0 0.06 to a fraction. The lowest or most simplest fraction is 3 over 50. Thanks for watching.